Hello. I got my water. I'm in a good hydrated boy. Bong. I was just checking over the VOD yesterday to see some of my the, the, the highlights again. There were three Nerdola moments. The Carnage one, the Scream one, and the Anti-Venom one. It was, a, it was a good Nerdola day. <laughs> I'm going to head up these symbiotides before we continue the story. Once the hives are done, then we're pretty much like straight sailing until the end. And I feel like we're kind of getting into like the last act or so, and I don't really... I might not want to... Like cut off a segment or something. My headset's caught. This fucking clip on the, this headset does my nothing sometimes. Yum. Zoop. Zoop. Oh, yep. Over here. Better check out that nest. There it is. Get Ugh. ready for some grim dark. Grim dark, such a good word. This never gets easier. Bonk. <laughs> Fucking right on the Oh. Hi, all you right? I don't really use a Sonic. I, I do like not that sentry. I do use Sonic gadgets in the combat. I would say I don't really use that much, but that is, I would say that's incorrect. Whoa. Ah, get up me! Oosh! Boom! I am very bad at upgrading the gadgets in general because even even the other games, I didn't really use them that much. To be fair. And it's just like, not for any particular reason, I just like... Use them way less compared to everything else. So maybe I should. I just keep forgetting. Boom! Shoot over there! Boom! Now that we uh, we have Scream in this universe, albeit for like for creations very differently than it is in, in 616. Actually, we have the other ones. So like, if you don't know from the comics, uh, Scream is one of five symbiotes who are spawned off Venom by the Life Foundation, partially adapted in Venom the movie. Uh, I don't know what they're called. There's so Scream. There is Riot, Lash or Lasher, I'd say we'll go Lash for now, uh, Riot, Lash, Scream, Agony, and Phage, I think are the five, I'll be curious if any more Lash, yeah, I'll be curious if any more of them exist in this universe. Thanks, Spider-Man. Whoa, that was messed up. Are you a doctor? Rocker. No, an EMT. Spider-Man was hitting you pretty hard. Hey, if that's what he had to do to get it off me, I'm grateful. This one, then we get this one, and there's fucking one more way over here, which is bloody fucking awkward, like so. He kicked up, eh? Hey? Jeez. <laughs> it, it is Lasher. Is it? Okay. I knew it was Lasher, Lasher, or one of the two, anyway. Yeah, the life. <laughs> the Life Foundation symbiote, anyway, you'll commonly hear them called. If you remember Noodle in the that Carnage comic I gave to you, to, uh, you read that one time? That was the Life Foundation symbiote. Apart from Scream, it was the other. I believe it was the other four. And they took over the, the the parents and the two kids. That was that was them. 
Lashes in the human. Ah, that's right. The fucking spiky hair, boy. Yeah, that's right. It's something about the, the, the way the white accentuates the curves. There we go. If that's a nest, I better check it out. Plop. Okay. Calming breath. I'm ready. Let's go. Oosh. They, they, maybe the ass line is hidden better with like the, the, the darker suits. They keep coming. Uh oh. Get up there. Yep. Ah, get bamboozled. God, the ant vampires are so powerful. Oof. Ah, yep. Get over there. Oosh. Someone's attacking it. Hey. Get away from that. Boom. Boom. Woo. Baba boy. Hey, just don't stand a chance, sir. Eh? Oh, boom. Yeah, in, the, in the comics where I'm at recently, so like 2021, uh, there's a new symbiote called Silence, which is formed by like a mixture of uh, Scream and the Anti Venom. The uh, like, symbiote, quote unquote. It's quite cool. It's got a cool like white, white design to it. Oh shit, they're fucking it up. A few more seconds. Ah, you're too late, Baku. <laughs> it's the shadows. The scream fight was great. Yeah, I, I, I don't know if you saw the VOD all over. Like as soon as as soon as MJ's hand comes up from behind the sofa, and you see her hand, like the red and yellow, it's like that's scream. Big Nerdola. Cool having MJ as a, as a scream though. Yum. I'm kind of sad we didn't see Carnage, but I, I I guess Carnage is big enough that they want to keep Carnage for his own thing, whether it's the DLC or another game or something. But very cool seeing Scream. And her design looked great as well. It was very, like... like a, a lot of the villains in this universe, their suits are more, like, armored and stuff. But... Uh, Scream and Venom both are like, just like fucking great. I love their they're very comic like. Because they don't have to make them really armored. Nest. Those things freak me out. That's not to say I don't like the armored versions. Like I really like Rhino's design. Let's clean this place up. Her lines are more brittle. Yeah, it's kinda sad. MJ kind of trying to fight three is sweet though, but yeah, it's Battle of Words as well. Oosh. They were they were flighting, flighting as well as fighting. Yep. Get out of there. Bonk. Whew. Gotcha. And we I love them doing the We Are Venom finally. Like, I was like, yes. Uh, yeah. 
But yeah, we've set up a few things now, like a few, like, I wouldn't say loose threads, that, that implies, like, they've been forgotten, more like they've been intentionally left open. Like, we have, chame we know chameleons out there, we know carnage is on the horizon, in terms of the universe, not, in terms of, not necessarily in terms of story. So I'll be very curious uh, if we're going to get a DLC. Or if not, or if we're going straight into Wolverine. But you also won't hear me compla complain about. Almost there. That was very exciting, but probably a long way off. Makes me sad. Yep. Fuck off. There was apparently a report that Wolverine is going to be set in Madripur, which is like, with my kind of guess, but excellent if true. It's, it's like a great new setting to get away from the the New York, if you want to do that. I mean, Carnage, Carnage DLC would be fucking excellent. I'll be there day one, boy. This one's so far. Oh, there's fucking two of them over there. <laughs> Shit! Okay. Well, that was my... I said we we're gonna do it. Because then we can just have, like, straight story for probably the rest of the game. One more list thread, I don't know. Oh, sick. From, from um, the main story or from, like, side stuff? Because we're kind of getting towards the end of the side stuff now, I would say. So I'm assuming it's probably main story then. Based on how good the the Venom and Scream designs look, I imagine the Carnage design will be sick as well. It's interesting because if, if I think about it, <clears throat> I would say... I would say Chameleon probably lends itself more to a DLC than Carnage, but... Who knows? You don't think you don't want to touch the symbiote anymore? See, it's why I would I would say like I wouldn't think like Spider-Man 3 would be Carnage because it would be too similar despite Carnage's whole deal being very different than Venom. He's a fucking mass murderer. <laughs> But I do kind of agree. I don't think they'll... I don't want them to leave them forever. It also seemed like the Scream symbiote, like, died when Peter took it off MG. But there's always... They could always just say, oh, God. A bit of a survivor or something like that. But I do think they'll they'll not dive into it immediately. Another nest. Yeah, they'll not skip it, go? but, like, yeah, I'm like... Is it these things with the DLC. Yeah, I, I think if they, I think if they were DLC, they would probably do like a trio, yeah, like like they did with the city that never sleeps. I love I love how much um, that story has come has like mattered in this with with Yuri. Like Yuri's whole like wraith story is so important because of because of that city that never sleeps. And also technically introduce Black Cat as well. To be fair, but I feel like you could get in, you, you could understand enough about Black Cat from how she's presented in this, but like it's very important to Yuri becoming Wraith. Like what was the the second one? Right, the sec the second part is the kind of the Yuri Hammer sorry, I'm fucking getting distracted. The Yuri Hammerhead one. Part 3 would be more Silver Sable. And also Hammerhead, I guess. But <laughs> he's a fucking... Uh, stuff like Grim fucking Jaeger at that stage. Yo. Catch! Yep. Get out of there. It's almost fully synced. Here to there. Whoop. 
Gonna go in the good way. Here we go. Boom. Get off your nail tool. Second is your in hammer focus and third refine for victims. That's all oh, that's also true, yeah. That was <laughs> That's where that has this. You're safe now. Uh, Take yeah. A breather, and when you're ready, get inside. It has the victims with the tape, right? And then the... The, the recording tapes on the police tape. That's right. So it was part three. Yeah, part, in, in my head, I when I think, like... I think of Hammerhead across all three of them, but specifically, I think, like... In my head, I specifically associate Hammerhead more with part two. I don't really think of it as the, the Yuri part, even though it technically is. But I go... In my head, it's like Black Cat, Hammerhead, and Silver Sable. Which I guess if we want to be it as the three women, it kind of makes more sense. Maybe I should think of it as the Yuri part. Black Cat Yuri and uh, Silver Sable. Yeah. Yeah, that makes more sense, actually. All right. Boom. Another nest. That last one was rough. I think this is the last one. Stay in control, Pete. Nope. Let's go. Do this. Get up. Stay focused, Pete. Oh. Okay. Yep. Thank you. side of the study. <laughs> to continue the story. Bonk. Bonk. Little sonic bomb itself. Oof. Oof. No joy, sir. That person on the ground there was a chef, but it's like a baseball cap they're wearing. I thought it was like a fucking jet set. Actually, shit. Uh oh. Hey, boys. Nice, you're too late. Too late. Exterminator. We got him. The king in black suit? Oh, That's fucking yes. Time for the city to start healing. Let's fucking go, huh? Where was that at? Down here at the bottom, probably, right? Uh, I also kind of want to wear the Peach Momoko Kumo suit. It's a mile suit? Oh, interesting.
Oh, that's the Dark Ages hit. Oh, cool. This I'm trying to think. So during the, so what I assume this is during King during the King and so I thought it would be kind of like a Null suit, but during the King in Black event when Null attacks Earth, Miles gets infected by one of the symbiotes. I wonder, I'm trying to remember if that's what it looked like. The fact that it's going to Miles makes me assume it is. Or at least invokes the... Um, the style of the event, and Null in general, I guess. Yeah, I can't remember. Either way, very cool. That was a good event. I really like, um, I'm a big fan of the symbiote, uh, stuff in the comics. It's some of my favorite stuff. So I loved the, uh, the King in Black event. Like, I loved everything with Null. Um. Uh, like, the, like, when they kill Null and Eddie becomes the King in Black. And he's like a, like a galactic, like, Guardian, basically. Like, he basically, like, has access to the Clintar hive mind, and he just, like, exists in one place, connected to this big hive mind chair, and commands all these, like, symbiotes to go out and, like, watch over the galaxy, and all fucking sick. My current week that I'm on, I'm just about to have a new volume of Venom start, where... Uh, like uh, the first Venom, the first volume starting with Eddie as the King in Black and Eddie's son Dylan as Venom, uh, and it's written by Al Ewing as well. He's one of my favorite Marvel writers, so I'm really excited to read that. But yes, King in Black event, very cool. I like that a lot. Nerdola moment over. Let's go. Time to go uh, check in on Harry here. Huh? Where am I at? Norman, what are you doing? <laughs> yeah. Is Venom here? Oof. I think he might be. <laughs> yep. There's Norman. We still have got Green Goblin too, com like common as well. It's so cool, like. Venom voice is so good. Look at us. We are healthy, strong. This is what you want, isn't it? Stop, Harry! We can help you! Get the boy. Oof. Run, Dr. Connors, run. Where's the rest of it? He's looking for the meteorite, right? I can see Green Goblin being in uh Please don't in three. That thing. I think we're about to find out. You need to know. Harry's gone. Host and symbiote are perfectly fused. Oh, Jesus. I'll find a way to save him. You can't. But you can still stop the symbiote. How? Norm By killing the host. Norman's big green shirt uh, definitely feels very like goblins coming. Please. 
Save my boy. It's interesting, right? Because, like, mm -mm. while this Norman Osborne has definitely done, like, bad things, I don't think he's inherently, like, terrible. As, like, Norman tends to be. Oh, we saw from the vision, right, or something that he wanted, like, encase the world in a symbiote, which happened during the King in Black event. Like, Null put a big, like, symbiote sphere around the... Around the Earth in that event. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. I guess I'm thinking more in terms of like how he interacts with people. Well, this uh, this ain't looking good. He's not yet actively murdering people. That is true. <laughs> oh God. Well. Oh my God. Fucking Christ. Not just a vision anymore. I know you're seeing what I'm seeing right now. We've got a lot of New Yorkers being attacked by these things. Fucking Nadir Dalal. Stay safe out there. Police era. All he needed was that meteorite. Uh, now he can heal the world. Fireman as well. We meant. Ish. The Avengers are gonna come back like. What the fuck happened? <laughs> I wonder if we ever do get the Avengers. Will it be set during the events of this of this game? It'll be like more set on the West Coast. It'll be interesting to see. <laughs> fucking cunt chilling out. Lucky how eating pizza beside him. Like, I'll be like, if. I, I hope we do get Avengers eventually. And they, they let Insomniac just, like, work away in this universe. Like, would it be, like, the Avengers have come back to New York and we can use the New York, like, map again? Or. Do we. Set it before slash during the Spider Man games? And you know, we see what the Avengers were up to. Those civilians are in trouble. I'm coming. I'm down for either. Honestly, I'm just kind of curious what they would do. I guess like what whatever happens with Wolf like when is Wolverine set? I think it'll be uh, really interesting. But it's also if it's set in Madripoor, then it's kind of like disconnected from what's happening in New York. So, fuck the place looks so grim. Huh? Really cool, like but very grim. There's the bus. We gotta save those people from nope. the symbiotes. I'll take care of these things. Just stay inside the bus. Oh. Boy, whatever it is, 10, 1098, 1048, or whatever it is, this universe. Really, really good. I'm really, really excited to see them start tackling some of the other, like, spheres, if you know what I mean. Like, the, the X-Men sphere, the Spider-Man sphere, the Avengers sphere. Oh. Fucking Jonah on the side of the boss. Oh, there's melting. Oops. Oh, he's still jumping away. Stop it, you fucker. Alright, you're getting bombed. You're all safe. Get home quick. Is not safe. I mean, if you don't have a place to go, beast is open to anyone. Thank you, Spider-Man. That was the scariest thing ever. Miles, we have to talk. No kidding. Hmm. There are nests popping up everywhere. Shit. Sending you coordinates now. Got it. Watch yourself out there, man. You reunite this with our boy Wolverine. Something else. Whoa. Harry. Find you, buddy. 
Oh, what was Somewhere. I say? <laughs> yep. Oh. Ah, <laughs> oh, Mars got a new suit. That suit's not an alien, is it? Time for a Miles Morales original, you know? One of one. <laughs> That's good. But do we can do we canonically have to use the new suits? For the rest okay, of the story then? Man. Harry got the meteorite. I uh I couldn't stop him. Connor said we can't save him, so we have I can't lose him, Miles. I can't do this again. Hmm. I saw me when I was in your head. It's not your fault, Pete. She wanted to save you. To save all of us. She never thought about herself. Even when she was struggling to breathe. If May, my dad, if they were here, they would want us to stop thinking about them. They'd want us to help people. To fight. Harry's still in there. And we're gonna fight like hell to get him back. Let's go. It ain't looking great, Miles, to be honest, though. Call the play, coach. Let's split up. Cover more ground. You find the meteorite, I'll clear that nest out. You got it, Spider Man. <laughs> Is that with the last one? Yeah, they're all Miles Morales originals, I guess. <laughs> hey, stay safe out there. Let me know you're okay. I'm impressed the phone survive all this shit time. Clear it out and move on to the next. Hey, we did about fucking six of these ten months ago. <laughs> hey, yup. Oh, we don't have the fucking anti-venom on Miles. Oh no. Huh? Looks like that scared you, huh? I must be on to something important for you to try to defend yourself like this. I have suddenly realized. <laughs> Yo. Did they rely more on the Sonic stuff now? Yo. Oh, Venom. What? Where am I? Boom. Where's that voice coming from? I can't let them get to the heart. Yeah, Tony Todd's Venom voice is really good. Oh. Huh. Oh, I'm about to have power. He's speaking in my head. Keep looking for that meteor, right? Don't let him get in your head. Woo. Not hearing. Ah. Right. You're right. Call me when you finish up. Stay Boom. focused, Pete. Still a minute left. Ah. <laughs> get Sonic Bomb. Ooh. Ooh. Fucking stay away, you bastard. Oh. Ah. Your time's running out. Get out of my head, but I'm 
Pero... ¡Bum! ¡Au! ¡Fuck off! Keep away for a little bit longer. We're fine, we got... Oh, now if they start fucking blasting it, we're not. Ten more seconds! Boom! Get right there. Did she keep all Gurgis? Hey, Coco, got you alright? Still here. Uh oh. No way that thing is talking to me. Uh oh. Come with us. Oh shit. Oh fucking hell. What the hell? We're in the hive. Where am I? You are home. <laughs> When people turn into symbiotes, you are safe here. Where's Null, huh? Everyone you love is safe here. My head. I have to find a way out. Why would you leave? Yeah. We are here. You can't be too. The imagery is great, though. You. Hey, everyone. All right. Peter. Us. This isn't where I belong, Harry. Neither do you. Come on, Miles. Come on. Get the fuck out of here, Miles. Bring us, Peter. That's not the way, Harry. You know that. Pete and I, we're gonna save you from this. Uh oh. Oh no. Haley? No. What are you showing me? Fuck out! Got out. Haley's in trouble. Pete, I saw the meteorite. It's under the Harlem subway station, next to the bridge. Are you gonna Pete? Ah, oh, fucking rapid swap back and forth here. Let's go. Wait for me though, man. Harry, he's after you. And the birds are like, wait, fucking right? run! <laughs> whoa, whoa, back up! What happened? I got sucked into the high pipe. I saw this vision of the meteorite underground. But yep. I've got a bad feeling. You think Harry's there? Yep. I'm serious, Pete. Just give me ten minutes. You cannot do this alone. He's gonna do this alone. Right. Call me when you're done. Sorry, Miles, but I can't waste any time. E. Stop There's points. the subway entrance. Miles has to be right. That's Oi. where the meteorite is. Just have to clear out this bridge. Ah, now you're fucked now. Stay in your cars. And even time. Let them hurt you. Harry! Venom! I know you're here. Yes, I'm here, buddy. I know. Just hang on. I'm coming. Push. Man, the mother. Whoa. Whoa. Come on, come on. I'm trying as fast as I can. Coming out of the subway Whoa. tunnel. The meteorite has to be under. Oh God. Talk to me! I have to get underground. I can't leave these people behind. That's good, Mike. Oosh! I'm going as fast as I can, man. Whoa. Huh. Get the bomb in, yep. As is my cultural heritage. Push. Oh. 
Oh no. Two of you, not now. It's getting out of hand. Now there are two of them. Maybe. No. Oh. Come on, Spike. Almost done. Harry! Can you hear me? Just stay there. Find you, buddy. I'm coming. Got him. There, the subway tunnel. Hey, everything all good with Haley? Uh -oh. Not yet. But you still owe me a few more minutes. <laughs> Hang tight. Let's go, Miles. Come on. You motherfuckers masked up. Haley! No! What are you doing here? Monsters attacked, and I offered up the center for shelter. Why are you here? Shouldn't you be out there fighting? I was, I was trying to save. You. You're incredible. Hm? I, I like you so much, and I think you like me. Do you want to go out on a date? You suit. I like it. It suits you. Is that a yes? I'm a world famous artist now. I'm busy. But I'll check my calendar. We'll see. <laughs> well, it's a date then. After all this is over. Mm hmm. Bye. <laughs> yes. I'm on the way. Hopefully he waited. I don't think he did though. He didn't wait. Harry! Find the meteorite. Hey, it's Harry. Leave a message. Hey, buddy. I talked to Dr. Connors. He says you're too far gone. But I know that's not true. The designer in the here looks so Harry, sweet. I messed up. It was terrible to you. <laughs> Your dream. Our dream. Healing the world. I'm sorry. God. We are here. Huh. here. Uh. I'm here. Are you finally ready? Uh. Oh yeah, that's on the Terry TV thing, yeah, I keep forgetting. Oh shit. Ah! I wanna help you, Harry! Oh no. Spider-Man! Oh god! Where are you? Uh. Did you go down there? You were right! It has to be here! He has to I'm sorry, I couldn't! I know, man. I'll try Whoa. to find a way inside. I got my Everyone's gonna be okay! Huh. Or maybe lighting. Yup. Huh. Please help us, Peter. Huh. We need you. 
I'm trying, buddy. I just need that meter right, okay? God, what the fucking shit show it is in here. <laughs> Miles, I'm not seeing a rock. No? Hold on, I'm nearly to you. Uh-oh. Thanks for coming, Pete. Hm? We want to show you something. So cool. We can't stay here. Bail, bail. Need to meet it by May's house. What's going on out there, guys? It's the meteorite that the symbiote arrived in. He's using it to transform the city. I know where it is. And we're gonna steal it. Time to game plan. Meteorite heist. Then, see you guys at home. Oops. There we go. <laughs> and he went the wrong way from the little slipstream. <laughs> Caught in one of the fucking barricades, so. I wonder if you would go to play the earlier games now, would they feel slow? Like, I felt those games felt really fast, but with, like, with how much faster it feels than us now, like, would they feel sluggish? I don't know. Yum. God. Ah, uh, Jonah. Stay inside your homes. Lock the doors. Board the windows. Trust no one. Yum. The city is overrun with a miasma of massive, oppressive tendrils emanating from the ground. Uh, what the fuck would you do, huh? <laughs> spawning creatures from what feels like hell itself. They're capturing us, converting us, and will soon overtake us. Don't give them the chance. While the government sits on its hands. I would not be out walking around, eh? Listeners have taken to the forums, looking for any signs of weakness these creatures show. We will defend ourselves. Yeah, not doing a good job of uh, tamping down the paranoia. If this last week's events have proven oh, shit. beyond a shadow of a doubt, it's that the hero Is it? make things worse. Alright, let me get our last upgrade done. Where's our Sonic gadget then? Sonic Burst. Alright. Get the Furby Critter some fucking TLC, huh? There you go, bio. Some some love fee, huh? Uh which one's this? Venom Venom Clouds. You think for the galvanize? Yep. In the meantime, let's go. Stay safe. Remain vigilant. All right, Jonah. We will get through this. New York does not go down without a fight. Let's go. And I we planning. Central Park Reservoir. No rock. The water system. Pumping goo everywhere, adding more and more people to the hive mind. All those symbiotes got out of Manhattan. Goodbye, Earth. 
Hello, Planet Goo. The meteorite is the source of all the power, right? Creating goo, creating symbiotes. But it was useless until Harry repaired it. Yeah. And that particle accelerator is what damaged it in the first place. Cut off a piece at low power. Right, so what if we crank the power up? Like way past 11. Might destroy it. And free everyone connected to the hive mind. Mm. Theoretically. But that reservoir's gotta be mobbed with symbiotes. And you know Harry's not gonna let that rock out of his sight. Unless he sees something he wants more. Goblin. Me. Just, you know, for illustrative. Interesting purposes. to use a goblin piece. Harry's still Harry. For Harry. He thinks he's healing the world. But the dream isn't complete without his best friend beside him. I can lead Harry away from the meteorite. And I can handle all the symbiotes. While I grab the space rock for illustrative purposes. <laughs> all right, fire up the accelerator. No more hive mind. World saved. We all get churros? <laughs> Theoretically. Pete, what Connor said about Harry being too far gone. Excuse me. If you can't save him, are you won't ready? come to that. You two will be able to destroy the rock in time. Let's heal the world. For real this time. Let's go. Let's go. They on patrol. So the meteorite is somewhere in that thing? So are Harry and his friends. Here. I figured you could use a sonic touch. <sighs> They're just standing there. Menacingly. What are they waiting for? Look. I can't thank you both enough. For everything. Come on, bro. We're the spider team. <laughs> Don't anyone forget it. Let's go. Squad up. Okay, so why he's the lure of animal drive is his part. Hey, buddy. You gonna sit in there and play with your pet rock all night? Some people aren't attacking him. It's you and me, Harry. Like we always wanted. <sighs> oh. Oh. Up, Miles. Get their attention. MJ now. Uh. Nice. Sonic charges are handy. Oh, Jesus, still himself. You wanted a story, Watson. Let's go. Good luck to him. Shit. Ooh, ooh. Oh, balls. 
Uh oh, not water, no. Bloody Oscorp. My terrible third person shooter skills are. Sasabi. Owie. Oh no. Owie. Owie. Probably could have gone better. I'm sprinting. Or that they shoot it free or something, I wonder. Uh -oh. Just a normal rock. Fucking some people gonna grab her again, I wonder. I got shit, quick. No, me, I'd run out of fire or something. They're gonna be all over me. <laughs> Time to go. Time to bail. Run, Angie, run. Oh. Oh. Fuck me. Oh! Parkour. Run! Oh! I didn't kill them. They're still behind me. Probably could have stealth yet him, but I didn't think. <laughs> Music fucking banging. And they kind of just stop caring. Ah, fuck. Get a little job up. The ladder's a bit fucked. Up that ladder and I'm in the clear. There you go. Nearly there. Ah, fuck. You gotta be kidding me. Oh shit! Ah, oh, fucking hell. This is, this is a Resident Evil fight. Bro, I got hit and I got again. <laughs> I, was just, I was just trying to get up. You gotta be kidding me. I think that hurt it. 
I think so too. You over here, big bastard. Fuck you! Oh shit, wrong way. That symbiote's big, but I'm fast. Ah, fuck you, bastard. Let's get the hell out of here. Yep. I guess I'm that. Time to go, Miles. Eesh. Bail! Bail! Uh, Peter getting chased by Venom. Pretty sure your plus one isn't invited to our high school reunion, Harry! Harry! Uh oh. I'm gonna land you from above. Oof! Ah. Oof! Work for Oscorp. Chicken. Oh god. Ah. Oh shit. Please remember everything we've been through. Oh. How we Owie, Zowie! Got that flat. What is he doing? Gotta stay off the ground. Oh. Oh fuck. Oh snappy moids. Oh yum 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 yum. Oh fuck. Ah. Ah. Oh god. Ooh. I jumped away the bastard thing. Oh. Keep dodging with your lid. You came over every single day after school. Uh oh, got to stop. Uh oh, the fucking mods again. Yo. Oh, they fucking eerie and dark. Whoop. Oh, we could also do the land as well. Oh, he's over here. Okay. I thought he was like just waiting underground. When you lost her, that day on the football field, I was there. Always have been. Until we got sick again. Ah! Uh, cool. While we were fighting for our lives. I was trying to save you! Didn't oh. feel like that to us. Oh. 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 We're giving you a chance, Pete. Ah! Fuck you. Fucking hell, man. Keep reacting way too late. Fuck, man. 
Again, muscle memory is making normally dodge as well. Fucking hell. There's a tech point there, probably at least. Oh god. Ah. Oh. You want to join us? Get the fuck off me. It ain't happening, Bucko. Why do you keep fighting us? You're not giving me a She's some following some dudes. Cheating her. Huh? Where about him go? Oh, there we are. Not working. Ah. Ah, oh, why did I I meant to heal? And my mind saw the the two flashy buttons and it went <laughs> press them. Enough. Fuck. I don't have enough health. Shit. Why my poor knee. You're not giving me a choice. Symbiote's dropping in. Ah, stop it. Did it again. Ow! Take about one at a time. Oh, I do have the surge. Oh, yeah. I keep forgetting. I guess I completely forgot about it when we lost the Venom. Fuck, I'm, I'm getting so overwhelmed that I can concentrate. I got. I got concentrate on anything. I got my mind getting like. Burr, burr. After everything we've done for you. Take my painkillers. No, I'm only leaving for. I don't want to take too many in one day, so I'm leaving them until tonight. Why do you keep fighting us? You're not giving me a choice. Whoa, symbiote's dropping in. Stay calm. Take about one at a time. Sweating currently. Ah, uh, fuck me getting overwhelmed, but again, I can't fucking give up. It's not working. Yeah. After everything we've done. I'm melting here, just. Whew. Whoa, symbiote's dropping in. I'm trying very hard to keep on top of the, the enemy as well. It's like jumping away from me as well. Stay calm. Take about one at a time. I'm trying, but they jumping away from me and then five other ones hit me. It's just too much for me, my brain can't handle it right now. Trying to hit one thing, it jumps away, and five other things hit me. I can't hit them, they're fucking jumping away. Take those things out. I just can't I go over to swing at them or punch it and they fucking jump away. I can't touch them. After everything we've done for you. Whoa, symbiote's dropping in. I can't beat her. Not working. Symbiote's dropping in. 
I feel like using the gadgets like insta kills them and ruins the whole point of them being here, which is the charge their abilities. But I can't fucking get them. They can fucking get from the way. I can't hit them. I can't get them. They fucking. Oh, you fucking. It's okay. I'm trying to parry more of Venom attacks. No, get him, get him, get him. Get Venom. Get the shield off you, sir. Burn him. Boom. Boom. I need to parry him. Oh god. Everything you ever wanted. Ah. Ooh. I should have been better. I'm so sorry. Boom. Whoop. You replaced us. Whoop. Poison you against us. I did the No. He should again. Just like I'll save you. Up oh, it. Boom. Boom. Oh. We've never been good enough for you. Oh. Fucking Norman's always a point of messing with your head, Harry. You're my best friend. Oh. Then why don't you trust us? Nah, should have been closer for that one. Fuck that up. As he said earlier as well, in the house. Oof. More these guys? Stupid fucking zombie old son. Brute force isn't working. Ah. There's gotta be a better way. Uh, yep. Ah, yep. Bomb him. There we go. Boom. Doosh. 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 Burn him. Hang on now. Oof. Boom. Oh shit, that was it. Fuck me. Okay, I'm not getting the next stage at least. Oh dear. <laughs> it's not working. Doesn't matter what you do to me. I'm never gonna heal the world with you. Not like this. The meteorite. Mm -mm. You took it from us. The fucking wings. Yes. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's from the fucking Donny Cates run. Ah, oh, that was that's I fucking love that shit. I think the goo aliens are mad we took their stuff. Yeah, well, they started it. Ah, fucking Christ, sir. Take him to the particle accelerator, right? Let's get this to the accelerator! 
Fuck off. Stay out. MJ, you hearing that? Uh oh. Oh dear. Alright, oh, that's fucking sick. Ah, oh, Peter's looking not good. Oh. The accelerator. Uh oh. Uh. He's okay, right? Let's just get him out of here. Fuck, 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 fuck. Set her name. Boom. Boom. Oh. Ah. Save the boy. Cast it into the fire. Doggo and Tetsop. Miles, so many fucking clutch moments in this. Uh, some of the sonic bombs. Uh oh. 
Bum. 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 In the forest, we remember what you did. Oh, fuck me. Man, that's the symbol you're talking, not you. You were jealous. That's why. Oh, fuck me. You pushed us so far. Maybe I was. But Pete wasn't Pete. Boom. Boom. <laughs> Silly little web toy. You think ah! you're better than us, don't you? This ain't about who's better. I just prefer you without the psycho alien on. Any heals? I guess not. Fuck. I need an elf. You're not doing this for me. You're doing this for yourself. You're holding you back. Ah, uh, yep. You took him away from us. Took him away. What the hell are you talking about? Yep. Boom. I never got power. Lion. Knock him out of the air. Oh shit. Doesn't matter if you like me or not. I'm here for you. Sonic bomb just dissipated. Whoa. Oh Let's fucking hell. This. Oh, caught him in air. I fucking got it. No. We gave you our chance. Oof. Harry. A little high head, huh? Give chase, give chase. <laughs> Get his little feetsies. Mild, no. Too fair, Mild's a fucking G. I hated it. It's great in that fight. That's so cool. Was had, huh? Pete, what's happening? Just hang on, buddy. Please, no. I'll leave him. Oh. <laughs> Give me that fucking meteorite, you bastard. Go, Miles, run. Fucking launch him away. Go, Miles. <laughs> ah! Fucking Christ! Oh! <laughs> oh!
Oh god. Barnum. Fight, Harry! Fight! I can't. I'm done. You have to kill us. He's going to the fucking bell tire. Probably oh, not. My triggers are resistant, bruh. Uh. Uh. Oh, God. I won't see any hot balls, though. Watch out for the glass. I'm done. Either way, P. No, no, no. We still have time? No, we don't. It'll kill them. And then it'll kill you. Let's heal the world, Pete. Together. Oh, God. Shoot it! Shoot it! the peeps I wonder what would have happened then to the you know the carnage symbiote was in the little tube it was it protected or you know
Far enough. Oh, yeah, yeah, true. It could be a distance thing as well. Yeah, it did seem to be like an area, an AOE. Yeah. Damn. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, can they like uh, the fibrillator room? Give me some room. <laughs> I don't know if it's gonna work, but I gotta try. Like fucking Storm and Norman coming in there now. Drop the green shirt time. Harry. Pulse is weak. We gotta move. What have you done? What have you done to him? I'm so sorry. What have I done? I'm coming with you, wait. That's true about the tie, yeah. Green jacket. There are traces of brain activity, but purple pants. His chances of coming back are very slim. Just keep him alive. Are you going to take vengeance against Spider-Man? Hey, oh no. <laughs> He's alive, Norman. Spider-Man did this. Why? It's like the fucking Hannibal Buress meme. You're shooting the guy in the chair. How could Spider-Man do this? Get. The G serum ready. ASAP. <laughs> uh oh. Back to formula. <sighs> oh lord, he coming. For the last few years, tragedy has tried to tear the city apart. But we somehow kept going. We battled sickness, evil, cataclysm. We are tired, anxious, stressed, numb. But we have never lost hope. And the Green Goblin is on his way. <laughs> the city needs to heal. We're all ready to return to normal, but... What is normal? What if it no longer exists? MJ moving him. Over the last half hour, I've talked about how these events have changed me. Doing a podcast. But what about you? 
In this ongoing series, I will be talking with people throughout the city, exploring our new behaviors, new routines, new thoughts and feelings. Hm. I hope you'll join me on this journey. This has been Mary Jane Watson, and you're listening to The New Normal. Everyone doing a podcast, eh? <laughs> What's the difference between wheat cakes, I'm pancakes, so and flapjacks? Done. Nice. <laughs> I don't know. Ooh, are these good to go? The king and Carcosa? Oh, minute. shit. Huh? I want to show you something first. Jesus. Okay. It o has okay. Molasses in it. Mm -hmm. Yum, I'll take those. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Thanks again for the donation, Peter. Peter's also wearing green. Huh? Have you talked to Miles about? Not yet. Oh. You ready? Uh, Miles. I I've been meaning to talk to you. Is Peter taking a break? About uh, I mean, I have been talking to you all, all the time. It's, it's, it's great uh, to talk. So many good talks. I just haven't been talking to you about what I should have been talking to you about. Pete. Hm. Uh, wait, uh, let me start again. I got this. Hm. All of it. Go be Peter Parker for a while. Are you, are you sure? It's, hm. it's a big city. I can handle it. As long as I can still call you for advice. You don't need it. <laughs> Maybe not now, but there'll come a time. I'm here for you. Always. Hey, bro. Aw. Plus, the, you know, the Fantastic Four are on the way, but that's kind of not not the point they're making. Yep, that's right. The the, the last EMF thing. Yeah, good shot. Well, they are. Uh, oh, you fucking screwed up. Sick. Well, they are overall thoughts then at the end. Spoilers. They're very positive. <laughs> I wonder then if we're going to get Spider-Man three, and it's it's just Miles as the main character. I can see it. Like fucking rip for how many fucking characters died this game? Man? Fucking half the rogues gallery's gone. Craven got his head button off. The Venom symbiote is dead. Scream symbiote dead. Scorpion dead. Vulture Rhino presumably Rhino. Uh, Shocker and boy, they're all fucking gone. Goblin forcing Peter out of retirement. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, it could be. 
<clears throat> like maybe maybe Miles has been acting independently for a while. I could see that. Yeah. So I imagine if we get a DLC for this one, then it'll be Miles. Just it makes it makes sense story wise. I get the G serum. It's funny when I hear when I hear G serum, my mind immediately goes to the G virus from uh, Resident Evil Two. But very clearly back to formula. A venom killing Craven was brutal, huh? Like obviously they didn't show him fucking chomp. Oh yeah, and Tombstone's fucking like we we freed Tombstone right. We got him out and we sent him on his way. Oh yeah, so Venom or Craven's end was grim. Ah, uh, Lizard was great. Uh. I'm trying to think, like, in terms, I'm looking at this now in terms of like its own, like, the implications on the universe going forward. Like, Peter will get a Carnage DLC. They need to get rid of the Anti Venom. It's way too strong to keep. Whenever I think about Anti Venom, I associate it with Flash Thompson. So maybe they, maybe they pass it on. I love how we basically had both of Flash's suits on other ca on other characters, right? We had the the Agent Venom suit on Harry, basically, and then we had the Anti Venom suit on Peter. Miles would get the Chameleon DLC. Interesting. I'll be. I I wonder if they are working on DLC. I would like to hope so, because the fucking world and characters are great. But yeah, we lost a load of villains. But yeah, we have um, yeah, Cletus Cassidy has the. What will become the Carnage symbiote? Um, and they're prepping for that. Uh, Wraith is still out there. Um, what else? Blizzard has been healed again. Uh, Martin Lee is depowered. Uh, yeah, a bunch of the Sinister Six are dead. What else? Yeah, Norman is absolutely fucking teeing up to become Green Goblin. I mean, there's, there's still tons of stuff you can do, like... Oh, yeah, uh, fucking uh, Aaron has retired as Prowler. I'm trying to think who I, who I would like next. Like, Carnage is an obvious one, but I think they will leave Carnage for a while. Like, I'm just like, what are we going to do for Wolverine? Like, who's going to be our our main villain? Is it going to be, like, Omega Red or Sabretooth or just the Sentinels or, like, uh, just Weapon X? Are we going to see Deadpool? Like, oh, man. Huh? Oh, it's going to be fun. Huh? Can you imagine if we get to a stage where this Insomniac universe is doing, like, Galactus or something like that? That's going to be so fucking hoot. And here's the thing as well. I, I really liked Weapon X and or Sabretooth. I really liked the Guardians of the Galaxy game. But like, what are the Guardians of the Galaxy in this universe? By Insomniac, you know? It's like, oh. The possibilities are great, you know. But like, just the fact that we're taking our first steps now outside the Spider-Man sphere and we're going into like Wolverine and the X-Men and stuff is like, very, very exciting. We get a post credit scene. We had one in the other games, didn't we? Like uh, Harry in the back to tank and stuff like that with the, with the symbiote. Oh, 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 oh. The raft is by Norman. Yep. Auto. What do you want? The Spider-Man. You know who they are. Uh -oh. Don't you? Are you a rat, Otto? Why? <sighs> they ruined my son. Uh-oh. 
Otto going through a back in his face saying, You did that yourself, Norman. Fucking do it, too. Two? Good. We all have to experience loss. Even you, Norman. <laughs> Green Goblin is going to kill Otto Octavius. The final chapter. Hey, don't say that. No, 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 no. No, 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 no final chapter, huh? This song's banging, by the way. It's the one that played during the intro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One more after this time. Oh, there's oh Christos uh, Gage. Yeah, he's a comic artist. I've, I've read quite a bit of. Uh, Anjali there. Yeah, Anjali Bamani. There she is. Deborah Wilson. Oh, very cool. Name recognize. Oh, Femby was uh, very good. Alan Tudyk? Where the fuck is Alan? Get Alan Tudyk in a major role, huh? Fred, like Fred Tataskior, however you say his name, Soldier 76. Nathan Fillion? What the fuck is this? Is additional cast? Where was like Nathan? Huh? It was just regular. There was just, like additional voices, wasn't it? Yeah, Nathan Fillion was there, like in the additional voices. Yeah, I worry when Norman goes full Green Goblin, he's going to come back and pay Otto a visit. I don't think it'll be good. I don't like that final chapter shit. Like, no, like, like... If, the, if that's the story they want to tell, I'm not going to deny, deny them that, but like... Don't say that to me, man. Nailed on. Excellent. Think we're going to start judgment tomorrow. <laughs> JJJ, Danica, Aaron. It's funny because I, I, I only just watched yeah the flame slash Cletus Cassidy yeah. I only just watched um, the Venom movie recently, um, and I, 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 the, two, the two voices I love this Venom voice. I need to uh, download Judgment tonight. The fucking message popped up you could probably couldn't see it because it was blocked by my webcam but like at the moment where like peter was carrying harry's body and was like fan fancy 16 has now been installed <laughs> not, not the time lads not the time i've not been drinking my water why do we wait for the credits to roll i mean i suppose i can give thoughts now while we're waiting for the credits to write i mean it's fucking great it was so good like the the first two games are some of my favorite PlayStation games, and this is like give me more what I wanted. But, but like it, it was it, it felt so much faster. The, like all the new combat stuff was great. It looked fantastic. I love how they did. I'm trying to think that like I don't really focus on. I think the third act's a little rushed. I had a great time with it honestly. Like I love Venom. 
what would you what would you say is the third act for, like from like the introduction of Venom? Would you say it's the third act? I'm trying, I'm trying to like splice it up in my head. Ah, cold water. How you get some boot and suddenly it's the end of the world. Yeah, I guess so. It's very like um doomsday kind of like doomsday with a lowercase d not dc doomsday killing killing villains villains off is always kind of sad it means you can't see them again but like um i i kind of have this approach with the mcu as well like because you're like and it's uh, even more so for this because you only get a game every few years you can make bigger draw and I'm more comparing this to the comics it's why I feel characters don't stay dead as much in the comics or for as long because you're getting the comics like, doo -doo 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 -doo, like all the time whereas in this you're getting one game every few years so you can make bigger swings and bigger events and have them last longer just in terms of like the fucking time between entries in the universe so I do I do agree there was last mile stuff um, and I think that was purely based on kind of Venom being the overarching. Like, obviously, Craven was a, l a large part of it, but with Venom being so important and Venom being Harry, yeah, a lot of it led itself to Peter's story. Um, but yeah, I remember going in as well, like, when we were kind of having a chat when we were replaying the other games, I was trying to think, how did I feel? that this would do Venom without um, Eddie Brock. Because I, I like when the universe does things different, but, like, I like stuff, like, at least keeping things like that kind of consistent. I actually didn't mind it. Like, my big thing was that, like, it was going to be Venom, like, immediately. Like, skipping the Peter stage and everything like that, but they did that. They did the Peter stage, and yeah, so that stuff was all, all sweet, so I actually didn't mind it. Now, would I like to see the, like, uh, am I kind of sad that Venom symbiote has seemingly died and can't continue? Yes, because, like, Venom, the symbiote, and the characters, and it, the, and everything it bonds to, it's, it's, it's one of my favorite things in the comics. Whether it's Eddie or Flash or anything like that. Um, so, like, I would, I would love if we could go from this initial, like, villainous Venom to... Venom beginning to, um, yeah, like, Venom learning to be a hero. I would really like if they did that, but I guess not. The evolution from Harry to Agent Venom to Black to Spider-Man to Venom was really good. Yeah, I like that a lot. And I love seeing the Agent Venom suit anyway, even if it was on Harry. Um, that's my one, like, kind of sad thing, but, like, yeah, it's, it's, it, I got that in the comics. You know, I'm not going to be mad that they don't give me that exact story in this universe. It's a different universe, and it's a different story. Um, so I'm not I'm not gonna put that against them. If I skip this, it'll skip to the post credit scene, right? If not, what watching YouTube? Is this Miles and Haley? Hope you're hungry. <laughs> Starving. Food's almost ready. Why don't you go show her your essay? He worked so hard on it. So, what's this about? Some guy in Harlem. Probably seen him volunteering in the city, helping out his city council mom, and trying to live up to his hero dad. Yeah, she just like rushed through the last part. It's very cute. <laughs> I like that version of that person. Yeah. Hmm. 
Not wearing your suit. Yeah. That's right, that's the scarf she gives him, right? Doesn't Haley give him that scarf in like the Miles game? You get like the the cozy suits really. Oh. He <laughs> he. Oh. This is a Christian household. Oh, is this her date? Her double dating, right? Hi. Miles, Haley. Uh oh. This is Albert. Uh, hi. Nice to meet you. Like Al, huh? Oh, and uh, this is my daughter, Cindy. So ah! Ah! Let's go! We're getting so cute. Oh, yo. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> the moon, I was like, Albert Moon. Huh? But as soon as he said daughter, I was like, <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Huh? What's up, New York? The last one. Oh, we're chatting about that, right? Like, would we ever see Sulk? Uh, I'll be very curious how they do use Sulk, because in the comics, she's bitten by the same spider that bit Peter. Welcome and she was, like, kept in a bunker for quite a while. We did it. We survived the impossible. Drove back yep, makes sense. The last one's here. Invasion, and we did it. Sorry, Danica. Leave that stuff. Away. Oh well, I I really like. I mean, maybe maybe okay. the bunker stuff. Yeah. Just wanted to let you know you got a package here at the house. Okay. See, there it gets. In the garage for you. It's from Norman Osborne. Oh no. Oh, interesting. Thanks for letting me know. Yeah, I was gonna say yeah, and then there's like this, this whole thing where they're like, the pheromones and the connection between the fact they're bit by the same spider. They're really, really horny for each other. <laughs> so. How I wanted you to have this. What's this? They drop that pretty quickly, though. Like it, the, the, it ends pretty quickly, though. They say you should never plug in a drive of unknown origin. I I really like uh, Cindy though. I, Silk. I really like her. The bees. Ah, oh, hi. I put this together for you because I knew when we got through this crazy time, whenever we got through it, I wanted you to have these. And I wasn't positive I'd be here to give them to you myself. <sighs> Harry. After the Emily May Foundation was Bathard. destroyed by Craven's hunters, I went to see what I could recover before it got boarded up. In the box, you'll find a piece of bark from my mom's tree. And one of May's blossoms. Oh. And I thought if you gene splice them together, hmm. you might get a hardy enough plant to produce seeds. Hmm. Well, well, okay. Okay. So we need one of each. Right. I usually just hail Mary one of them into a random spot. Fuck. <laughs> it didn't work. Do we have any that have a... Shit, now we have... There... Is there... That one would, would need to go there. Nothing has blue trios in the upper right apart from this. Okay. Okay, so we'll start with the sun there. 
Oh, literally the only thing that can go beside it is this, which leads to our earlier problem. What about that? Not there, maybe? What is it about this fucking hitch piece that's causing the problem? Now, oh, shit, we need, to, we need the hitch in there. Alright, let's get another look at this. Alright, this hitch piece is just weird, so what is the. What if we put it here? Do we have something that could plug in? Yeah, I think the first point of call is to... Nope, can't put it there because we had to, we had to put that there. And then nothing else has the three, like, blues in the top left to connect here. Okay, what if we put it here? Does anything have this? So then we could do that and... This or the water beside it, but we'll go from here and we'll see kind of how this leads. Nope. Maybe this. Out there. Not so nothing fits there then. Okay. Okay. Can't remember what I have beside this. It was the sun or the the other shit. This might be the same pattern I had beforehand, but just tinkering for a second. No. I'm using this HP as like my uh, fucking the one one I'm working around because it's got weird patterns. Do I fun do with Felicia? I don't think I've encountered much of Cindy with Felicia, honestly. <clears throat> Main stuff I've encountered Cindy with is the Agents of Atlas. I had a solo run with her recently that was very fun as well, so. Um. No, it doesn't work. We would have to put the water on there. I think I had the sun here and it didn't work. It means I would need to go there. And then we have nothing with the two green ticks in the top left. Okay, I'll have to put it there. So then we've only got one thing that can connect here. But then we have none that can connect. Right, like if we put the sun here, then there is no other option that can connect up here. But if we put the sun here, then there is nothing that can connect here. Because there's nothing that has a little orange tick on its right side. So this one can't go down there. What about here? So there are two options to put above it. The leaf and the sun. The sun can also go below it. The sun could go here. And the leaf could go here. And there's only one option for there. No, there's no... Nothing for here. Hmm. Leaf there. Now nothing can connect here because there's nothing with the fucking blue text on the top. Okay. Okay, it can only be the sun up here. It can only be the leaf here. <sighs> Again, we're at an issue where there's only one piece that can fit in either of these spots, so it would be blank. Okay, blue text on top right there are the water and the sun. And the same too for the other side. <laughs> okay, the sun can't go here because nothing can connect there. Hmm. 
This is gonna be the one that drives me off the edge, isn't it? See, the fucking sun can't go here either, because nothing can connect there. Green ticks in bottom left. Only this one. Only the sun. An orange tick on its left side. Only this one. Okay. So whatever goes here has the blue ticks in top left. None of them. <sighs> right, the H can't be there. Oh no, the sun can, but I already put the sun somewhere else, didn't I? Yeah, because if I put the sun here, then nothing can go up there. And if I put the sun up the hair, nothing can go here. This HP is a fucking bollocks. Can I just put it in the middle? Have it connected nothing? I'm not reading comments. I don't want any... don't want any help. I feel like I put it in all the spots. There, not there. Okay, two options for here. But water is the only one that can go there. <sighs> okay. So these, either of these two can go here. But only the sun can go here. And then nothing fits there. <sighs> I thought it'd be like that there. Hmm. Hmm. Nope, that doesn't work. <sighs> grumble, 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 grumble. I'm seeing so many of these symbols, I keep forgetting which fucking order I've done them in. I can't remember if I had the water here or here. Maybe I just, like, start slotting them in, just, like, no-brain it, you know, and just, like... Um... Just be like, ah, like, ah, looks good. Just follow it around and eventually I'll just hit the right answer. Sure. Seems grand. Mm, yeah. Grass there. Ah, fuck it. Oh, no, nothing can fit in there. Excellent. Could only be this. Could be one of these two. So we'll go from the other side first. Oh, never mind. There's nothing to put in here. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Isn't that wonderful? What about down here now? Oh, no, there's nothing I can put down here. Oh, fucking great. Huh? Isn't that just jolly, huh? If I put this down here, is there anything from up here? Yes, we have a leaf from up here. So now both of these need a green connection on the right side. Oh, when you look at it. We only have one, huh? That's just fucking... That's just wonderful, huh? That's just... Beautiful. That's... Peachy, huh? Um... Okay. So in this position, the sun can... only go here. But then there's nothing for here. <laughs> Gonna go insane. Okay, there's two options for either side here, I think. And... That there. That there. 
white in the bottom. Green. And then nothing fits. Hmm. We're back here again. It goes there. And only the... Is there anything that can go here now because I put the, the sun up top? Does anything else have a blue in the top? Nope. No. So there are certain positions the fucking H can't be. <sighs> um. So the sun can go below it or the water can go below it. Uh, do we have anything that can connect here? Yes. Water. Sun there. There we go. Go out there, boys. Uh. I knew you could do it, Pete. Now, you know those little bee drones we salvaged for the field studies? We just leverage their relocation data sets to plant those seeds around the city. You're some kind of genius, Harry Osborne. Let's get those bees. Time to fucking germinate the city. I know, I know. It'll be years before we see the results. And who's to say where you and I will be a week from now, hmm. let alone years from now? I'd be curious what Harry will be like, what Harry's role will be in, in three. So Emily and May will Aww. live on in the city and, of course, in us. Sweet. I love you, Pete. Aww. I really do. And I know the foundation didn't end up going the way I'd hoped, but there's still no one I'd rather have tried it with. I bet by the time you get this, we'll have already started a new foundation. Just me and you. From scratch. Go us. Go us. Name. Oh. One last thing. Can you sit? Got a little something for you. Good help. Okay. I thought the that reminds me of the Spider-Man life story. It is the fucking life story sit. Look at that there, boy, huh? He's just a fucking he's just a comic whiz, huh? I recognize him tomorrow. Life Spider-Man life story, very good, very good Fresh and comic. Clean. A new day for this world. Staring down the face of the apocalypse offers a new perspective on life. That's the one where it's like um Spider-Man story, but like time progresses. Uh, like the decades actually move. Looks like Ant-Man. It's meant to be um. More space suit like. I'm pretty I think he goes to space towards the end of that story. I can see the Ant-Man comparison though. Uh, that's us, huh? Yeah, I'm actually fucking like really like really impressed I did the whole map. I think like taking the, the random crimes off the map was a great choice. I never felt interested in really doing them, and like the fact that they held up the map completion really always fucking pissed me off. Like, but I'm, so I'm so glad they made the decision to take that off because everything else was really interesting. So, but a fantastic game, really, really, really good. I hope they do DLC, uh, and if not, I'll be here day one for Wolverine. It's gonna be fucking good. But yeah, great universe, great characters. Third great game. I had a fucking blast. This is my second most. Anticipated game of the year after uh, uh, Jedi Survivor. Oh, fuck, it's been a fucking sick year. So, so good. So, so, so good. Uh, but, Way to begin. that'll be us now until we hopefully get it. Like I said, hopefully we get a DLC. If not, that'll be the end. Brilliant time.
Really, really good. So tomorrow we will return to Yakuza slash Like a Dragon with Judgment. Should be good. Thanks for watching Spider-Man 2. Been a fantastic, fantastic time. Uh, but yeah, back for tomorrow at the start of Judgment. Yakuza time, let's go. Have a good night, everyone. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.